Hi, we are Lion Babe, and this is Sounds. We met at school at a party, and I was playing some music, and then Jill was into it, and she came over to me and said, what's up? Years later, <laughs> we ended up uh, just talking and reconnecting. We just had a natural connection as far as just what we liked and what we wanted to make and what we thought was cool. I think we have a unique sound. There's something there, I think, that has a very natural glue to it. The real drive comes from our own personal ideas of what we're, we feel is lacking in music or what we want in music and what we miss. We definitely pull from old classic soul and like the idea of timelessness and songs and music. You could play a song now, you could play it in 10 years and it still feels the same. It has its own energy. So I think creating that kind of environment um, now is, is definitely something that um, is exciting. And I think that's why people are responding the way they are. With Pharrell, that was obviously very exciting for us. You know, he's like a hero for us. We grew up on his music and his sound. So, you know, part of our childhood and definitely a big influence, you know. The session itself was amazing. You know, he, we came in, obviously, it was a bit intimidating, you know, going in. It's like, oh, my God, here he is. But, uh... It was really cool, you know, he was so cool and it was definitely on like some mentor type, you know, sensei level where it's like we came, kind of came in and he just taught us a lot, you know, musically definitely, but also just like on life vibe mm -hmm. and how to, you know, be true yourself and just really get what you want out of it, you know, creatively or whatever. I think the buzz is just really exciting. It's exciting to kind of almost just hear back after hiding out and making so much music that people are into what we're doing. We're pretty much pretty calm as people and like to just be ourselves and work on music and be creative. So um, I don't think either of us are really into kind of get famous or anything like that. So um, I think it's just it's going to be exciting to just have more fans and a bigger audience and hopefully bigger platforms to do bigger shows and make more music, collaborate. So I think it's just gonna push us harder to just be better. I think image is important in a way that, it's, it's funny because even with my hair and kind of the manifestation of like a literal being, being a literal lion and all of that, oh my good, goodness, look at her, like sh her hair is so crazy and stuff. But I think it's just like, it, it's definitely feels right. We're just being ourselves. I mean, when I met, Lucas, he was wearing the exact same thing <laughs> that he's probably wearing now. And, you know, with me, I feel like um, I can I can embrace my hair being giant. I can also just wear it completely normal and natural. And it's just almost having fun and not taking yourself too seriously and drawing in things that I've been inspired by my whole life and um, women that I identify with, who I also think are legendary and trying to bring that back into my own look. We are looking for a longevity. I think we found something, and I always knew I was going to be an artist for my entire life. I think Lucas felt the same way. So it's building the initial kind of groundwork of um, where this can go, you know, where he can go as a producer, where I can go as an artist and performer. I like being inspired, and I hope to do the same with other people. So.